Oleg Fedyakov. Two more competitors representing the Detroit Skating Club. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Jamie Silverstein and Justin Bacaric. So the third phase of the ice dance competition on tap now inside Gund Arena. The free dance worth 50% of the overall score, lasting four minutes. Terry Gannon, Susie Wynn, Leslie Visser with you as Jamie Silverstein and Justin Pekarik step onto the ice. Many believe they could become the best American ice dance couple ever. Currently in second place. Well, every time they step on the ice, expect to see a great performance. Through this whole first section, they're just holding on with really one arm each. Shows a lot of strength, a lot of coordination. And they bridge all of the required elements in a very difficult and creative way. Opening up with one of their first dance lifts, the five to seven that are required. And watch how quickly they turn in the circular footwork pattern. Both of them have very difficult footwork, and they're so skilled and well coordinated with one another. their first season competing at the senior level. They swept both the U.S. title and the world championship last year on the junior level. Jamie, only 16 years of age, just did apply for a driver's license, originally from Pittsburgh, and Justin, 18 years old, from Southfield, Michigan. from high to low and he changes curves and they do it so well they're really getting into the spirit of the music they seem to understand what they're trying to say through their theme It's got to be an unusual situation, too, with their training partners. The reigning champs, Lang and Chernyshev, still to come here. Sharing the same ice during practices, sharing the same coach as well. I think that really pushes you when you have your fiercest competitor right in the same, same house, so to speak. What makes them so good is how capable they are. Their coaches, Liz Coates and Igor Spilbon, have done an exceptional job at setting such a strong base for them. When you have that base, you can really be creative, as you can see here in this rotational lift. Just extraordinary positions, unusual strength and flexibility. and seniors quite a big jump and they're handling it so beautifully teamed up in 95 six months later they won the novice championship and there's a look at justin's father john and his sister sarah silverstein's out here as well the entire family here to watch them the novice championship they won the junior championship last year 
Could they have just captured their first senior title? Have to wait to find out. When the required lift is a change, a direction lift, where you can see Justin has to change curve. She's changing position while he makes the transition. A lot of things can happen in that transition, and they really do it well. Well, there's a look at the very serious-looking panel of judges who will decide the fate of these skaters today. Susie, what's going through their minds as they watch the action now? What the judges are looking for in the ice dance event, the required elements, which include dance lifts, dance spins, and footwork sequences. They're also looking for unison and leg line throughout the program. Speed and flow are also very important. Closeness and difficulty in both the footwork and the choreography. In every one of those categories, it's hard to find fault with what Silverstein and Bacaric just did. Listen to the crowd right now as the first of two sets of marks is announced. Technical merit 5.5 up to 5.8. Well, those 5.8 look good to me, and, and those are the marks that I'd be giving them as well. Well, Eagle